flow form A. Uh, this is how you are going to save your scratch coding assignments and turn them in for credit. First off, you need to log in as your student account. Um, I have created an account for Lamont, Lamont V. And so I'm going to go through as if I were a student in Mr. Miller's class. So first I have to create my code. And so while I am in this, then I will have done my code. I will follow one of the tutorials. The one that we did before break was create animations that talk. And so I go through all of the various steps, making the code, having the cat do different things. So we have all the code, go through all the steps, add the backdrop, add another character, perform the song, change the color, spin it around, grow and shrink, all those good things. I'm done with my code. Now I want to rename this. So it will be create animations that talk. And then I want to put my first initial for Lamont, it's L, and then his last name, F, because he's Lamont the fifth. And then I click the share button. Okay. That will bring it so that now anyone can see my code, but I want to see it says create animations, that talk, Lamont the fifth, and then instructions, click on cat to make him her. Whatever you needed, whatever your code is to have the animation do it. And then where it's, you don't need to do notes and credits. And then here is the key part where it says add to studio. So if I click on add to studio, I've got a couple of different options. I'm going to create animation stock. I want to add it to that studio, hit okay. And now I have turned in my assignment. Please rewatch this video if you need to, but that is how you turn in your coding assignments on Scratch. You have to share them and then add them to the appropriate studio.